Okay guys, so now we are going to do part 6, the last part, and to find out how we can do it. And I'm going to do that right now, it's going to be really ugly and you will not like it. So, it says to repeat number 4, with an ex but for an exponential distribution with parameter theta equals 20, and the interval from 0 to 150. So, part A, we need to find the mean and the standard deviation. So the mean is 20 and standard deviation is 20. It's an exponential distribution. So it, it will be straightforward for that part. Now part B is asking the density. The to plot the density. So what we're going to do is we're going to say u equals to our unif 1000 because part C is asking for 1000 then we can say x is equal to negative 20 times log of 1 minus u and x then x is equal to that so we got part C so now part B we're going to plot the density so plot density and of x and here we get the density you see from 0 to 150 now for that, that was part b and now part d says to compute the corresponding sample mean and standard deviation so we're going to say mean x is as 19.2 close to 20 and standard deviation of x again close to 20 also so part b part c part d that's good and part e says to plot a relative frequency histogram for a sample and superimpose with part a part b's density so what we're going to do is we're going to create a histogram all right as uh, part e for so create a histogram hist x break uh, breaks equal to let's say 50 okay comma frac equals to false and here we have an histogram so we need to superimpose that with the line or with the part b for the line so we're going to say lines now what i'm going to put here first is the interval where I need to make it which is from 0 to 150 and then I'm going to type in the formula for the exponential distribution so it's going to be 1 over theta theta is 20 times x exponential so it gets e to the power of and then negative now I'm going to get the interval from 0 to 150 and divided by 20 and then comma color equals to I'm going to say blue and here we go and this is the line for part E so we got part E done now part F says to part F says to use the plot use R to plot density for a simple and then superimpose with probability part B so it's not going to be really hard, it's just the same thing. What we're going to do is, we're going to plot density again. So plot density and of x. Then we get that. Then what we're going to do is again, rewrite that the formula for the line. So you're going to get line. And then from 0 to 150, comma 1 divided by 20 times the exponential formula. So x negative and zero to one fifty 
Guys, like I said, this was going to be the weirdest example. I'm not sure why we don't use the R exponent, but uh, well, it worked. So I guess. But yeah, if you wanted to know how to do this one, that's how you're gonna do it. So I hope it helped you, and I hope you understand. So thank you for watching the video, and. Other than that, have a good day. Bye.